Okay. Bear with me just while we make sure we got everything up and running again. should be good to go. So. Yep, that's there too. Alright, cool. <sighs> now. For reference, for anybody watching the VOD after the fact, uh, this is happening in the same session as the last VOD immediately afterwards. We just restarted so that it was a quick uh, a quick edit for the VOD side of things. We've just loaded into the Artorias of the Abyss DLC, which I am completely not knowing about, other than the fact that Artorias is in it, I guess, uh, and that we should do it before we fight Sif. Um, so, for archival reference, we are playing today at 1080p at a 6,000 bit rate. And it is currently 1.43 a.m. on the 7th of April. So, well, let's get things rolling. We'll get underway, hey? We'll see what's there. I'm hoping the audio is coming through. I didn't actually do an audio check. I should have done that to start with, hey? It would have been silly of me not to. Just a second... Should hopefully have sound there, do we? Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Zia. Zia we go. Alright. Looks like we lost a few lurkers, but that's okay. We will continue on. I don't. I have no idea what's what's coming up in this, by the way. I don't know if I'm going to be under leveled for this, but I guess I can't get home. Need humanity. Good luck. Oh, good. Oh, good. A bunch of people died in here, apparently. Um. Well, let's do this. Did that, even, did that not even work? did work, okay. And we'll chuck on that, I guess. So here we go. Oh, hello. Oh, you're big. I've got a feeling you move very quickly. Oop. Oh, hey, hello. Oh, it's like an AoE thing. That's gay. Ha, ha, ha. I mean, shit. It's not shit. Ah, okay. See, this is what happens when you guys talk about the uh, Electric Six and songs like Gay Bar, because then that song gets in my head and the words get in my head and I revert to 14 year old that thought that saying that was cool as, a, as an insult. It's not. It's not a good insult. Did I say that? Yes, I did, unfortunately. Hmm. But unfortunately, I was very incorrect, because there is absolutely nothing that is homosexual about that chimera. Or maybe there is, and that's totally cool. It's taken you many years to remove it from your vocab? Yeah. I'm I'm on the tail end of uh, removing it from mine. I'm hoping, uh, I'm hoping it will uh, disappear someday soon. Can we lock onto him, please? Oh, fuck, hello. He's, uh, he's rough. Is that death? No? How? How is that not death? Oh my god, stop it.
Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Ah. Ah. Good work, another four shot boss. Yeah, yeah, uh yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um Yep. Yep. Yeah. I'm guessing he was just a little a little babby boss. It's like, nope, that's the whole DLC. It's like, ah, oh, wicked, that was good. I liked it. I need cancelling. Well There have there has been unfortunately, and I I, re I regret that this happens, because I know that it's 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 pretty upsetting to a lot of people. I um the there's a certain word that has been said officially three times since I started streaming. Um and it only happens when I'm really angry with something, uh, and usually quite tired as well. Um, but I really, I'm really trying to get rid of it. Like it's just not a, it's not a cool word to say. That was notorious in cosplay. He's a fairy. Choice of creatures, chimera. Not a bad choice. Well, basically a chimera. Chimera with wings, I guess. I don't know what that was. Looked kind of like a chimera. <gasps> this place is pretty. Ah, this is pretty. And a bonfire? Pretty. Ah, this is pretty. I like it. Um. Let's drop another one in endurance, I guess. Um. We will leave. You angry? You grumpy mushroom person? No? Well, You're not? Okay. look at this one. From what far away age hast thou come? Thy scent is very human indeed, but not intolerable. Ah, Princess Dusk's savior. Thine aura mm. is precisely as she described. I thank thee deeply for rescuing her highness, but Princess Dusk is here no longer. Snatched away oh. by that horrifying primeval human. And so I must ask, mm -hmm. couldst thou once more play the savior? Be like, no, just ends the DLC I instantly. Elizabeth, guardian of this sanctuary, something of a godmother to Princess Dusk. I shall assist thee to my utmost, for I am one with the sorceries of Auraseal. Right. I mean... I don't know if you're the Guardian or the big Chimera that I just fought outside was the Guardian, because he was called Guardian. And you're called... Big Old Lady Mushroom. I think. Thou shalt see further on. An abyss was begat of the ancient beast, and threatens to swallow the whole of Ulysseel. Night Artorius came to stop this. But such a hero has nary a murmur of dark. Without doubt, he will be swallowed by the abyss, overcome by its utter blackness. Indeed, oh no. the abyss may be unstoppable. Still, I have faith that Princess Dusk may be rescued yet. Sick. Talk one more. Nope. Oh, okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. Ah. What do you got for sale? Repair powder. Hmm. Handy. Hidden weapon. Ancient sorcery of the lost land of Ulysseel. Turns the right weapon invisible. Not a simple augmentation, making dependent on the skill of the caster. An example of the capacity of Ulysseel sorceries to control light. So it's. A PvP spell? PvP crap? Yeah, I figured. Makes them invisible, makes you invisible. Cast light. Yeah, that would have been handy before. 
but whatever. Elementary, but nonetheless demonstrates the achievements and mysticism of Ula Seal. Uh, and a repair spell, which costs 10,000. Repair spell is not a bad idea. Ancient sorcerer of the lost land of Ula Seal transforms into something inconspicuous. Uh, that looks like it'll be funny. That looks like a funny spell. Hilarious. Hello again, Nobo. Welcome back. How's it going? Going well. Yeah, going pretty well. Um, it was going good. Uh, I kind of really want that because I think it would be funny. What else you got? Oh, the ivory catalyst? Yeah, that's shit. I don't want it. I don't want it. You can keep it. I don't do this just for the just for the laughs, just just for the fun of it. Like, what am I going to turn into? I just want to know. Tune magic. Yeah, this one will do. Where is it? There it is. Let's do it. <gasps> Shazam! The fuck? Am I? Uh Oh, I'm like a tree stump. Hmm. But I'm very off color when next to everything else. That's a. It's terrible. Do it again. Oh, it's just a tree stump. I don't turn into anything else. I'd love to turn into one of those statues because there's a lot of them. Nope. Alright then. That's fine. Hey, Nobo, you missed the conversation of which slurs are not okay to use in 2021. Well, I. I don't like to upset people. That's a mate. That's a big thing. That and there's way better insults. Slows are lazy insults. Like they're just... They're just lazy. They are. Well, this spells... At least just here is... I feel terrible. It's pretty terrible. Turns me into like a black goop thing. Like I thought it was a tree stump. It's kind of a tree stump. But I, uh, I don't know. I'm gonna get rid of it. Great soul arrow. There we go. Perfect. Which those are not okay. What did we come up with? Uh, essentially all of them. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty much. This is a nice little glade. I like this. It's quite pretty. Probably should have kindled that bonfire anyway. But we'll see. We'll push on. It's anyway always much more fun to come up with your own for someone when insulting them. Yep. Time for you to leave and do life stuff. Because I'm a big bigot. Is that you actually saying that you're going to go lurk and do stuff? Or are you... <laughs> are you just saying that I'm, you're cancelling me again? This place is pretty. No, you're really leaving? Alright. Okay, you will be missed, but enjoy your day. It has been a pleasure. Oh, a big forest place. Oh, what's that noise? What's clicking? They're clicking things. Are you really leaving? Not because of my language. Take care. Yeah, take care of yourself. It's been a pleasure, bud. Oh, hello, you. What the fuck are you? What even? Are you a tree man? But different to the other tree men? You're interesting. I like you. Lana, Artorius time? Hell yeah it is. G'day Swift. Welcome, welcome. Does Lurk help the stream in any way? Um, the command is just telling me that you're leaving. 
but actually leaving the stream on leave, basically it leaves us another another number of viewers um, which again it doesn't necessarily do anything for me directly but you know it's more um, uh, that I, I, I will appear further up the list than somebody that has uh, five viewers if they're six but I don't mind it's not, not, a, not, a, not a huge deal um, I don't mind if you go I'd still be here if there was uh, if there was zero of you here I'd just be talking to myself it would be a little bit lonely but I do appreciate it always always Ah, hello. Uh, no, shush. Go to sleep. Oh shit. No, I said you go to sleep. Uh oh. Ow! That's my face! I'm sorry, Mr. Stone Man. Ta ta for now. TTFN! Hoo hoo hoo! Let's just. Chuck one of these on. No, no, no. Running. You shouldn't run. You're in stone armor. So is this... Well, first off, it's daytime, which is great. But is this the, the basically the more of the forest? Like the dark, dark root... Dark root... Basin and shit? What's that? Oh, somebody dying. Thank you for the lurkib. What is this? What is that? Yeah, it feels it feels very much like Darker Garden. I don't know if it's a. I, I feel it's a, probably a brand new map. Oh, did it really just go between his legs? That's what she said. Um. Oh, here he comes. Come on, fella. Do a thing. And one of these, maybe? Yeah. There's a lot of forest. Is there a pack of those dudes in the middle? Oof. We'll deal with them. Let's get rid of them first. Just to see if they're protecting anything cool. I'm gonna try and make sure it targets him and not one of these other random side dudes. Nope, oh, alright, it's just gonna target a little bit of everybody. Helpful. Uh, where you going, bud? Are you okay? I feel like he had brainworms. Magic pew pew? Exactly. Pew pew pew! We're gonna shoot everybody. And then when we run out of shoots, we're gonna die. Because all we have left after sh after the no more shoots, there is stabs. And stabs aren't as good. It's pretty great though. Hello. Zalvigal. Ooh, pillage body. Yeah, right. Twinkling Titanite. Hey. Purple moss clump. Yeah, sure. Why not? I don't know. Is this? Nah, it can't be. Maybe it is. I don't know. I don't. I don't recognize. I don't recognize Darkroot Garden from its layout because it's just a fucking mess. Be nice about it. I'm, I'm saying it nicely. Um, but um, like, I feel like it might be the same. I think it is actually because there's the bridge. So on the other side of the bridge, there's a big fuck-off door. And then, like, down here, there was... Path over to it. I don't... I don't really... I feel like it is. I feel like it's the same place. Or, at the very least, it's made to feel like the same place. Speaking of Pew Pew, have you seen that there's a mod for Dark Souls 3 where you can get an AK-47? Are you for real? You have a gun playthrough? Uh, what are you playing as? Oh, an operative. Spec Ops. Like, you mean mage? Like, nah. Nah, nah, nah. I'm Bravo 6. Uh, 
I think it is actually, because there's like a path down here somewhere. It also goes to the same place, maybe. I don't know. Easy mode, yeah, with a gun. I can imagine. I think it would be a bit of a mess. Yeah, these are. They're the same dudes, because they're dropping the same shit. They're just... Later on, they're just little tree men instead of well-kept tree men. Mm. See? Well, wait, what? As in, well, wait, what? Because there is a gun mod, or well, wait, what? As in, this is the same place. Just got the same, the same like stone soldiery dudes and shit. Guardian leggings, AK forty-seven in Dark Souls three. Yeah, it sounds pretty nuts. Yeah, it is. It's the same place. It's probably a little bit different. But it's basically the same place. Is there anything up here? Hmm. Checking the developers were like, really wish we'd done more with that forest. It was a lot of fun. the knights aren't already laying down, which is kind of funny. So it's like, I came here and killed them. Oh shit. That was terrifying for a second. It was scary. It's a dragon boy. And this sort of leads back to... Yeah, 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 yeah. That's... Maybe? Maybe not. Makes you want to reinstall it? I hope it's smooth. It'd be fun to do if it was smooth. But if it's a bit of a mess, then it's sort of like... Like, some mods are very gimmicky. But I'd take a, I'd take a gun for a spin in Dark Souls. What rumbling? Why is there rumble? Oh. That, that, is that abyss, is it? Oh, wait. Hold on. Stop. Excuse me. No. Ow! Hey, fuck you, buddy. Get smashed. Please let me get up. this, you casual. Okay. It's very abyssy. Very big old hole in the ground. Oh, one of these things. No, no. There's something up there. I can't get up over there. I can jump it. Maybe. Probably right. I clear that. It's just a little baby gap. It's 
go. Yeah. Yeah. I can hear you. Are you just walking around over there? So these things. These goops of black goop. Oh, another one. I love it when games that don't have uh, a dedicated jump button have uh, platforming. It's super awesome. Ah, hey, sorry, didn't see you there, bud. I heard you like a second too late. These big old holes in the ground are a little bit, uh, a little bit how you going. Ooh, treasure. Elizabeth's mushroom. Ah. Uh, is it like a key or something? Feels like a key. Nope, oh, not a key. Upgrade material, maybe? Nope. Is it just a thing? It is. Greatly restores HP for a limited duration. Large medicinal mushroom of Elizabeth, keeper of, the, keeper of the sanctuary. Eating this mushroom invigorates the flesh and greatly restores HP for a limited duration. Its dramatic effect can make the difference between a warrior's life and death. Fair enough. Gotta be careful of big fuck off holes in the ground around here. Way to ruin a forest level. And I think this forest level's a little bit too easy. How can we mess with them a bit more? I don't know, just put a whole bunch of holes in the ground. Make them the same colour as the ground. It'll be great. Wait, is it becoming night time? Surely not. Dark Souls doesn't have a day-night cycle that you can actively affect. Probably. Don't walk away from me. How dare you. Goff's Great Arrow. Is it actually an arrow? No, it's not. I didn't think it was. Is it a key? Nope. Then what is it? Why are you giving me things that I don't understand? A dare you game. Wait a second. It's not, it's not like a sword or something, is it? No. Well... It was like a spell or something, was it? I don't know. I must have skipped past it when I scrolled through everything. I don't know. I don't know what Goff's Great Arrow is. I'm sure we'll find out after we need it. Or after we could have used it effectively. Give Moss Clump. More treasure! Guardian armor. So we know there's a dragon around too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know where I am. I know where I am. Kind of. It's a little bit different. 
but it's basically the same same dark root forest, which is pretty wicked. I love it when DLCs or, or sequels or whatever return to places that you've been before, but like reinvigorate them. I think it's quite cool. Still haven't been up there. Don't know how to get up there. I'll go around. Does this go anywhere that's interesting? Not really. Okay, you guys are running off that way, so that's the path to get to me. Or maybe they can't get to me and they're just running away. Like little babies. Come on, fellas. Oh, oh never mind. Sorry, mate. See ya. Oh, you only need one of them and they're dead. I grabbed that. Large soul of a proud knight. Mmm. Oh no, crystal thing! Ah, fuck you, lizard. Oh, hey. Hey, everybody. Yeah, fuck everybody. Clumps again. These big dudes, they get very confused. They have brainworms and shit that's going on. That's like, where, where are you going, bud? Walking around around the trees. I like it because it's an odd to it. Because like, all the guardian statues, or statues. They're like, oh, they're like doing like gardening shit. That's even cooler. That's so cool. like proper full-on keepers of the forest. And then in the real game, everything's overgrown because they just have lost, you know, I guess they're like ants. Hmm. The snippy boys don't aggro. Oh yeah, he does. He did after I grab that. You know, it's disappointing having to use Soul Spear on you guys, but just this once, you know. Hmm. I didn't like me picking up that single gold coin. It isn't really worth much unless you feed it to Frampt. They're like, hey, there's a little human running around. I'm like, yeah, that's me. Hmm. That's a big castle that I don't directly remember. Oh, hey. Hiya, fellas. I'm running out of spells. But we're doing a lot of exploring that we're not going to have to do a second time, so that's good. Yeah, this is the one that's above the big hole, yeah? Yeah. So the one that's above the big hole. Uh, 
If I'm a good shot, I can kill five more enemies. If they line up, I can kill more. I suppose... current day Darkroot Garden... more of this is like collapsed and shit? So that's why it's sort of a smaller area. Because this is where the cat is. The cat's hanging out in here. They look like switches. Yeah, the cat's hanging out on top of that. Is it the lamp making that noise? Oh, hey. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, I hope there's a button to get you back. Also, I can't get out that side of it. That's a way better way to summon lifts. Because that's where the cat is, because everything here is all like... I'm gonna fuck you up. And then old mate and his ninja friend are here. There's no bridge. No bridge between the two. Interesting. So it's the same. It's same, same, but different. Artorias! Indeed. Um, I suppose we go down. Because I don't think we can go anywhere off this side. This is all just cliff edge, yeah? Looks like it. Yeah, okay. We go down the lift. We're going to go down the lift. And... Maybe get ourselves into some trouble that we can't deal with because we don't have any spells. Okay, fog gate. If I do run out of spells, I'm just gonna homeward bone it and uh, just run pretty much straight back here. An elevator that's supposed to go down even further. We're not going to jump down a random hole right now when we have other splorins to do. Okay. Secret? No. Like, is that supposed to be, like, New Londo or something down there? Because it would kind of make sense. It is below it in a way. Mm -hmm. Elevators up, elevators down, big fuck off fog gate. Need master? Night ahead? Okay, well, 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 we'll deal with that boss in a moment, whatever that ends up being. Nothing else in this little glade area. Which is kind of interesting. Such a big space. Ooh, there's something. I'll have you. I'll have me some treasure. That. Go, 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 go. I will. I will. Don't, don't you worry your, your head over it, Lana. I'll be getting there soon. I just have five spells, so it's probably not a good time to walk into a boss fight. Oh. Hmm. Hello. Ah, let me guess. Snatched by a shadowy limb and dragged off to hmm. the past. That's me. Yes, yes, of course. Exactly what happened to me. We are both strangers in this strange land. But at least now there are two of us. You look like you're from Bloodborne. Did you happen across Knight Artorias? The legendary no. abyss walker from the old tales. Well, if you haven't, it's just as well. He's a colorless sort, if you ask me. <laughs> so Everyone seems to be. What did that giant mushroom make you do? Not that I care. It's none of my business. 
Didn't make me do anything. Mm. Well, I've little to talk about, really. Oh, you know me. What do I know? <laughs> mm. uh. <laughs> okay, what you got for sale? Ooh, anti-poison shit. Throwing knives, fire bombs, luring skulls, like all your consumables. Handy. Sells humanities too. Bunch of arrows. Yes, yeah, all your consumables. That's cool. So long. I like that he exists. There is stuff very far down there. Another elevator, but I can walk down on the other side, can't I? Here's a path. I'm going to follow the path. Fuck your elevator. He does, though. He does look like he's from Bloodborne. He's very uh, long trench coat. Um. Uh, yeah, it's cool. Cool looking outfit. I thought he was a statue walking up on him, but apparently not. Um. Be wary of lying in ambush. What? It does look like a pretty, uh... Oh. Hello. You're quite, uh... Quite difficult to see. Even though you're not the same colour as everything else. Large soul of a brave warrior. You dare me to kill the dragon? I probably will. Like I, I, I'm just gonna kill stuff as I go. I got no problem shooting some dragon. Just not gonna do it with three crystal spears. Well, maybe I would do it with three crystal spears, but I wouldn't. Uh, I wouldn't intentionally go into the fight with three crystal spears. Hello. You okay? Ow. Be still. Like, I don't know, is this supposed to be... Is this supposed to be the Valley of the Drakes? But, like, however long beforehand? Oh. First try. Ah. Uh, I don't know. Maybe. I haven't died yet. I'm about to, though. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't know. I'll take it. I'll, I'll, I'll give it a spin. There's been a handful of bosses I've killed first try. Partly because I'm OP as fuck. Enemy ahead. Price strike. Eve ghost. Um. Okay. With my two crystal soul spears now. Oh, okay. He sounds like a big boy. It's that same dragon, isn't it? Hello? Oh, fuck. That's, um... That's an arena, isn't it? That's a big arena. Oh, this is the basin. Yeah. Dark this is this is this is Dark Root Basin, big long ladder, waterfall. The hydra's like over that side, being a dick. Is there a fucking bonfire here somewhere? Can we see a bonfire from up here? 
Oh, hi, Crystal Lizard. Uh, I can't see a bonfire down there. That text just disappeared. Maybe there's a bonfire in the elevator. Being a mage, I don't feel very good only having two of, like... 40, 50, 60 spells, whatever the fuck it is that I normally have on me. And a stabbing stick. I got my poking stick. I want bonfire. Don't you XD me, Lana. Don't you even? I know that's sass. I know what that XD means. I'm watching you. Oh, no, you sad? No, 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 no. Don't be sad. Ooh, ooh, ooh. The, the, the elevator's got to have a bonfire, right? Surely. Because if that smoke gate is a boss and going down the ladder, probably going to have to deal with the dragon, then there should be a bonfire just here. No, no, go back. I, I, I will, but I just don't have any spells. The other side of the garden. Oh. Yeah, because this is how we get across normally. We come up here and then you can go across and there's a bridge. But there's no bridge here now. You think you're lost? Yeah. Oh, I'm, I'm like... I know where I am, but I don't. Because we're in the forest. And the forest is somewhere that I know, but I don't. Because it's the same, but different. Um, I don't exactly know what is in this glade either. Or if there is anything. Is this all the shit? Hold on. Did I come through here before and I've already killed everything and that's... Why it's so straightforward? Everything's already dead. That's good. That's good news. Because that means I can dart across there and hit that bonfire. And then just run across that bit of forest and go down the lift and we're sweet. No spending five million spells on every single end in the forest. I can use a bone. Of course I can. I always forget that I've got those. I have a shortcut now. Is it is that a, was that elevator a shortcut or was I just dumb and missed it the first time? Hello. Struggling, are we? If there's anything I can do. No. Wouldn't I wouldn't say that. It's kind of rude that you assumed that I that I was. But uh Okay. May the flame. Now just keep to the left hand side after the bridge and use the elevator. Be the right hand side, yeah. Cause the left hand side should take me all the way back around. Yes, yes. Right. Right indeed. Jump down. Jump down, tree man. Nope, okay. The Royal Wood. Hello. <laughs> uh, oh. Oh, okay. Good night, fellas. You're dumb dumb. No, no. It's just because everything is mirrored where you are. You're in a different hemisphere, so left is right and right is left. I completely understand. Mm -hmm. And then it should be just over here. Nothing to rub down to, no secrets? No, okay. There is some treasure just... No, it's not. That's the flower. Onto the lift. 
Nothing like walking in the forest barefoot, feeling nature in its raw form, and then murdering it, Michelle. Isn't that right? Welcome back, by the way. How was work? How has your meeting been going and etc.? Oh, think of anything that... Yes, I do actually. I'm going to snap up just a couple of these because I don't want to get stuck without them. I'm stuck with a vendor or in a, in a so place long. that doesn't have... You know what I mean. I don't want, I don't want to not have them. Gasp, murder in the forest? Shocked Pikachu. Oh yeah, that's 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 on the uh the list of different um uh emotes that I'm thinking about doing for the for the rabbit face. Thinking about having the to choc uh the chocolate Pikachu? The shocked Pikachu face. Ow. Holy fuck, calm down. Can we not play this? Fucking... Just be dead. Work is so tiresome now, you need some sleep to be honest. Mm. What time is it over there? Does the shock Pikachu face work with the streamer delay? I don't understand. It's 1834. Okay. Well, 6.30 is not too bad. But a nap is always better than no nap. Why did we kick? We had him. Oh, now he... I think he was confused. Ow! Jerk. Okay. Let us go down the... Ah, uh... oh, there he is, little fucker. Ah. Ha ha! Gotcha, bitch. Another ledge. And down here. And this one. Hey, ladder, how you doing? Uh. This place totally doesn't look like a boss fight arena, huh? Can I have treasure? Oh no. Oh, hello. What? What? Oh. He's a growed up. He can breathe way more fire than the one that, uh... <clears throat> is on a bridge. Okay. So like Seath and various other enemies slash and or bosses, he's going to be a problem unless I don't go that way. And there will be something else that I can deal with. You don't think I was supposed to kill him first try anyway? Yeah. Yeah, I... I, I kind of picked that. From, you know, being dead. Aren't you supposed to kill Artorius first? I don't know. I don't know. I haven't... I have never played this DLC before. I have no idea. Um... And then talk to the giant? Yeah, I have no, I have no idea what you're talking about. I am, um... I'm sort of avoiding any sort of, uh, yeah, spoilers is the wrong word, but I'm avoiding any sort of like game guide or like progression tips or who to kill first and all that sort of stuff. Yeah. Like I have a rough idea of what's going on, but I know nothing about the DLC at all. Hit me. Glad they headed a talking mushroom to the game. Yeah, me too. I'm a fan. Makes Dark Souls complete. I actually quite like this DLC because it's 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 Dark Root Forest and Dark Root Basin, but as a DLC. Um, 
I'm going to quickly run over to this little building. And I have to jump up for just a second. Um, I won't be going for long. I'll only be going for a minute. I'm just going to go and quickly pee. And we're going to go and uh, go through that boss door, I guess. And deal with that. But uh, I will be right back in just a moment. Or two moments, maybe. Okay, I have returned. Alright, so... If we can't do shit against that dragon right now, because he's just going to clear out the whole basin and destroy us... Um... Let's go in here and see what happens, hey? Why not? Oh... Ah, hey, he's dead. Good for him. Hello. Oh. Uh. uh hello. I am, I am friend. I love you. Oh, you, you, okay. I was about to say you want to get him off your sword first. How you doing, Notorious? Oh, you're a jumpy boy. This is going to be a mess. Oh, this is going to be a mess because he dodges. It's bad. You know, I do about a quarter of damage with the most powerful spell that I have. Also, He's just gonna fucking wreck me. I can't block that. At least not the jumping attack, anyway. Wait, hey, oh you, you get struggling. Found the guy. No, I'm not struggling. 
He took two hits to kill me, thank you very much. He's not even that good. <clears throat> Holy damage. Oh, yeah. This, this... Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty broken at the moment. What do you mean his damage? Because I think taking off a quarter of his health isn't too bad. All right, fellas, come on. Hello. Come on. Mm, that's not what I wanted. I don't appreciate it. All right. Can I show him? Can you? Okay. Yep. Hold on. I'll bring my stats up. Give me just a second. Dems the stats. So I haven't put a point in the vitality at all. At all, at all, at all. Um, that's the starting, the starting stats. But we've got through everyone so far. Like we've killed Ornstein, we've killed um, Ornstein Small, we've killed uh, the Lord, who have we got left of the Lord Souls. So we've just got to go after. Uh, we're just going to finish through, through New Londo, and we've got to fight Sif as well. But that'll be later. Um, so yeah, it's messy, and I get deaded very quickly, but uh, if I'm making an OP broken mage, one thing that people won't be able to say is that I uh, can tank a whole bunch of damage. And i got to figure out how to fight, uh, fight Artorius without getting murked immediately. What about the cat? Did you find it? The cat? I didn't see the cat. So the cat was in the little, the little room originally, but I haven't, uh, I haven't seen her in this, in this, uh, timeline? In this era? I guess. Did we come out of there? We came out of there, didn't we? Came out of this area. And there's like another, another room here that has like no elevator. And just bottomlessness. So. Like part of me wants to go down there and, and jump on that. But also I will probably just die because it will be an amazingly high fall. I'll get to the cat later. Oh, okay, so the cat is in this DLC. Excellent. Good to know. <clears throat> Frumple Stillskin, did you find it? Oh, you mean Scrumped. Haven't found Scrumped yet. Have not found Scrumped yet. No, fortunately. Through the door. Okay, we'll do this one real quick. Please, no. You know, that was me even rolling out of the way. Hm. Okay, I see how it is. I'm thirsty, leave me alone. Oh, that's a, that's a running lunge, I see. Timing? Spectacular. Just, just killer timing. Um, because I'm probably going to be here for a little bit, I am going to... Kindle this motherfucker. Not that I'll necessarily need 10. Or 15, I think it's at, at this point. But I may as well... Do it with the humanities that I've got, anyway. Okay. Surprised that only gave me 10 S's. I thought it was supposed to give me 15. Kindle. So you gotta kindle it twice to get it to 15? Hmm. Ten's fine. I can hear Twinkling. 
some twinkling happening around here. Because there's like no water in, in this place later, I don't think. Come down here, fellas. Come on. Ow. <laughs> uh, hold on a second. How did that not thrust through to get both of you? That's rude. Get out of my way. Move. This is going to be interesting because some of the bosses that we've we've fought so far have been relatively quick, but um, considering how quickly he can kill me, even when I'm blocking, and I think that the jump attack has semi homing on it, kind of, because I feel like I rolled out of the way of it and it still smashed me, or maybe it's an AOE. I don't know. I would have to check. I would have to check. But we'll see. I will smash him. Like, I don't exactly have levels and levels of stuff. I'm human now, too. Maybe there's summoning signs that people have left. Maybe not. I can hear breathing. He's ready, isn't he? I can see him. I can see the smoke through the fog. I can see you. I can see you in there, fella. What's this? Okay, 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 okay. Oh, no, no, no. No, thank you. Oof. Oh, dead. Fuck. He's very fast. He's gonna be tough. What have I got in the arena? It's just a circle. Because I'm not going to be able to kite him. Because he's just going to smash me. Greedy. Uh, I wouldn't have had time to heal or do anything anyway. He breaks my block. It's just more testing. It's more testing things at the moment. Um... Trying to think of what I've got. I mean, I can use homing soul mass, but it's only going to take off a bee's dick of health. Hello. How can you both attack at the same time? There we go. And also stand next to each other. That would also help. Um, because if we hit him, like, in theory, if we hit him with four crystal soul spears, he should be basically dead. He should be fucked. But, we can barely hit him with one, because he dodges so much, and he's so fast. He likes dodging. I know, right? He likes uh, he likes doing a bit of floppy fish. Just flip flopping all over the place. Um. Before I go charging in there again, I'm just gonna check what spells I've got on me. Not on me, but like, you know what I mean. What I have access to. Because I don't think that it's going to be, um... Yeah, I've got 
Hemming Crystal Soul Mass. What Dragon Breath, but it takes forever to cost. Um. Shields augmented by magic resistant to magic attacks and fire stability. That might work. You might not be able to break through it. Crystal Soul Spear deals the most damage. I'm pretty sure of what I've got th that I can actually use on him. Because um, I've got the Dragon's Breath. The Crystal Dragon's Breath spell where it takes... Um, I've actually got to uh, fill out a form and, and send off a letter whenever I want to cast it. And then wait uh, you know, three to five business days for it to actually cast. Um... Control repair. It's not really anything that's going to help me. Maybe some toxic clouds. I could always try pyromancies if all else fails. Have a bit of a muck around with them. Um, let's see if this stays on when I walk through the gate. Nope. Excellent. Shouldn't have done that. Oh, fuck you, buddy. What are you doing? What is that? Is that going to be a big kaboom? I don't know what you did. Did you just go Super Saiyan? I'll be pretty upset. Oh, you do two of them in a row. I see. Probably gonna cast one or two of the uh, spears on him when he was doing that big charge up. I reckon, I reckon. Because the crystal soul spear, a crystal, yeah, crystal soul spear is good, but I only have four of them. And if he's a dodgy boy, I might not hit him with any of them. So it's kind of about getting lucky ish. For, for my level of skill, it's a little bit about getting lucky anyway. I'm sure there are people that are like, no, you just got to time it right, and you can hit him with every single one. I'm like, eh. I don't, I don't do timing in Dark Souls. Ha, <laughs> he fell over. You shit. Oh, oh, I'm going to die. Hmm. Oh, I see. That didn't happen. You didn't see that. I was I was gone for a minute, and I, my um, uh, my little brother had the controller for a sec. That was that was it. He was he was here, um, at three o'clock in the morning, um, at the other side of the country from the rest of my family, uh, and also existed when I don't have a little brother. But he was here. He had it, and he played. It was just it was it was bad. I told him off for it and everything. I was like, hey man. They're like the easiest enemies in this area. It's 3 a.m. here. It certainly is. Well, 2.56, but yes. See how much better it is when I'm playing? When I'm the one with the controller? best time to play games is in the middle of the night. Yeah. Yeah. It's quiet. It's cooler. Yeah, it's such a difference, I don't know, right? Because I'm a pro at this point. Totally. Totally a pro. Um, the reason I'm letting Artorius kill me repeatedly is just to lull him into a false sense of security. It's a tactic I've used on most of the bosses so far, really. Joke Society is going to smash me again. Now I have.
have something in my left eye as well. Why now? Hold on a sec. He's doing a lot of breathing and shit. Okay. <sighs> I sort of have a bit of time. I can cast one of them on the way in, which might give me just, just a little bit of damage. Because the last thing that I want to do is to hit him, get a run where I hit him with all four of the Crystal Soul Spears, and then he's got, like, fuck all health left, and then I die. Because if I hit him with this, that might be the difference. Could be. Oh, I don't like that attack. Please let me move. Why are you just roaring at me? We go. He did. <sighs> Easy peasy. And I beat him first go. How crazy is that? Anywho. I did it. Oh, good for you, little buddy. Praise the sun. Try attacking. Yeah, thanks. There's nothing else in this place. Nothing else shiny. No new toys. Another fog gate. Lovely. Ooh, it's that time of the day. We're getting trucks. <gasps> Bonfire. Let me full sprint run to you. Fuck was that noise? I love that now he's dead, everyone's just silent. Disappointed. What the fuck are you? Some gross critter? Uh. Oh, this is Ulusile. Don't know where you are. Don't like it. Oh, you're still alive. Lovely. That's good. And now you're not. What the fuck are they doing? Are you guys itchy or like... What's going on? I think they're itchy. He just got fucking wrecked. You miss me killing Artor Artorius? Oh no. It was very quick too. It was a very quick death. I'll just give you a bop with my shillelagh. Bop. Oh, two bops maybe. Bop. <gasps> Don't tell me he wants a third bop. Four bops. Yeah, four bops. I wondered why you were so quiet after I did it. I was like, oh, she's in shock. She was amazed at how just, how I just beat him first go and, and stuff. Um, there's a lot of screaming down here. I'm pretty keen to continue on downwards, but... There's a fog gate up here with my name on it, and I want to know what's here.
Into the gazebo. Interesting choice of words. What's up here? Okay. Hmm. What is that noise? Big hole in the ground. That sounds like a trap. Sounds like some sort of like blade trap or something. It's locked. Okay. Well, we'll come back and check what, what's in there later. Uh, there's nothing here for me. Death by the looks of it. You have chosen death. Yeah. All right, let's enter the gazebo then. What's in here? Purple coward's crystal? Hey, what? Why did you give me purple coward's crystal? Exit Battle of Stoicism. What? Online player item. Quit Battle of Stoicism. Session ends if host leaves. Victory in this battle once led to an to ancient Anor Londo, but even in the absence of its overseer, capitulation is a disgrace. In the name of warrior's honor, do not quickly resort to the use of this crystal. Um. Okay. Battle of Stoicism is only available online. These bonfires. Oh. Oh. You can, assign, you can assign a password to pick specific opponents or comrades. Duels are 1v1, team battles are 2v2 or 3v3, and death matches are 4, v, four or 6 participants. Win streak resets to zero if player leaves the gazebo. There are three types of battle of stoicism matches, duel, team, and deathmatch. Sit at a blue bonfire to set number of combatants and search for a match. The battle is timed and will end... At the end, the winner goes... Oh, the winner dons a great crown. The warrior with the most kills received a great crown. With equal kills, all warriors received tiny crowns, which is a draw. Earn consecutive wins to be etched in the plaque of legends. Oh. Okay, so it's just, like, multiplayer PvP. Right. I mean... Deathmatch team. I feel one for one, it would take forever to find a match, probably. And two, it's kind of um. I'm not exactly built for PvP. <laughs> Basically, I'd have to get the first shot on them, and I'd have to hope that they aren't running any sort of uh, resistance to magic. Uh, so, Devil's mentioned before that you have a tattoo of Dark Souls. What's your tattoo? Is it a bon Is it just a bonfire, or is it a logo of some sort, or what have you got? Ow! I don't know how I killed that other guy with one shot, but all right. It's a bonfire? Yeah, nice. Very nice. Um, a lot of that's death. Death. Hey, you're different. I give you a poke? Poke. Oh, the mage is dead? Okay, cool. I can hear, like, so many more of them. 
Haha, -ha, there you are. How you doing, Cheeky? I do like a good good stabby sword. Soul of a brave warrior. So which one's your favourite, Lana? One, two, or three? Which one is your your bread and butter? I said that it's not. Oh yeah, no, it's a mimic. It is, it is. Oh no, it's not. No, it is. Yeah, it is. That's a mimic. Yeah. He's breathing, is he? Yeah, you fuck. I see you. You certainly don't like the second? You really like Dark Souls 3? Uh, Dark Souls, but Dark Souls 3 looks so much better. You like Bloodborne? Yeah. Bloodborne looks really cool. I'm guessing you know of the theory where that they're all in, like, the same universe, just like Bloodborne, Demon Souls, Dark Souls. Um, what if I give you a weapon with a sword, and then we do this, and then, can I, can you lock onto him please? Oh, did I just... Ah, 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 hello. Lucky there were stairs and not the edge. You've never heard that theory? A very good carving. Uh, what? A very good carving, are you for real? Uh, you never heard that theory. So, from what I understand, and I didn't read into it too much because... You know, I didn't want... I didn't want to know too much, I guess. But, and I haven't played Demon Souls or Bloodborne at all. Um... But from uh, what I understand, Demon Souls has a particular ending where the world is engulfed in like fog and mists and shit. And because Dark Souls starts with like the world was a grey nothingness or whatever, it's kind of like they're sort of like, okay, well, that ending is like the canon ending if you're going with this theory. Um, and then you have Dark Souls begin, and everything happens with Dark Souls. And then Dark Souls 2 happens, you know, an era later, or however many eras later. And Dark Souls 3 happens again later on. And then in Dark Souls 3, uh, there's a painting. Or, like, there's a little girl painting with blood. And she is painting a new world that is free from all this shit. And because it's going to last forever and whatever. And because she's painting with blood, it's like the, the this world is born of blood. Or Bloodborn. So it's like Bloodborn is the world within that painting, sort of thing. Depending on what ending you pick, it depends on how your game ends. Oh yeah, but I mean like, canon's canon. Head carved of arch trees by Goch in his imprisonment. Goff imparts an emotion to each and every completed carving, which helps him achieve personal enlightenment. When a head is disturbed, it speaks, reflecting the emotion conferred to it. This head says, very good. Have another look. Does it not appear quite jovial? What the fuck? What? That's very odd. But, okay. Sure. This just goes down and down and down. We might go the other side. Can we do that? Or is this going to be looping back and forth? Yeah, so that goes down here. So I kind of want to go over to there first. Uh, yep. 
What you got for me? Soul of a Brave Warrior, wonderful. Okay. Something's clip clopping. What's what? What do you mean? You said you mean. I don't know if you're writing a paragraph or if that was just the end of your sentence. <gasps> oh shit! She does things. Oh, that really fucking hurt and staggered me, and I don't like it. Oh, I'm not a fan. Get out of here. Get off my legs. Let there be light. I don't understand. What do you mean? Dude. Something's like trying to shoot me, I guess? Odd. That's weird. I don't understand, I guess. You wanted to say something, but then you were like, eh, nah. Yeah, that's fair. I do that all the time. Except I say things first, and then I say, eh, nah, and just hope that people didn't hear me. Ow! Okay, okay. Ah, oh, there's two of them. I see. get inside there if you have a special helmet. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Hello. Get stabbed. Hey, everybody. I'll be your driver today. They're loving it. It's all part of the fun. Come on, you two. You kind of aggroed before. Ah. Beautiful work. You got here just in time. Okay. That's a lift, which is going to be a shortcut later, I'm guessing. I think it's interesting that we killed Artorius already. Like, I feel like he would he would be like a... I don't know. A later kind of boss. But it's cool. Oh shit, that's right. Why are you pointing at me and laughing? That's weird. That'd be weird. You gonna do another one? Yeah, you are. Oh, that dodge, though. He's a bully. Yeah, he is. He is. I poke you with my poking stick. Uh, I want to drop down here, even though... I don't even know if this is the way that you're supposed to be going, but I'm just going to do it anyway. Don't laugh at me. Oh, he fell off the edge, I guess. Suck bum. Uh. Oh, hey, no, none of that dodging shit. Just be dead. Oh, hey. Ha 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 I laugh also. Ha 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 ha. That's how I cast my spells. I have to laugh with them. It's called Humomancy. Yeah, you 
fuck. I know you're there. Mm, cop that. Anywhere else around? Oh, hey, another one. Hello. Uh, Ab? Like, why would I not? I'm sorry, carving. Oh. Maybe I shouldn't have killed you? No. Is this going to be the whole... Some heads say I'm a dickhead. An arch tree carving that says I'm sorry. I don't know. My God, I got off in parts and emotion to each and every completed carving, which helps me with enlightenment with how disruptive speaks. This one says, I'm sorry. Isn't this an expression of atonement? Are these the stones that make stupid sounds? I have no idea. Do they make stupid sounds? So I can use them and make stupid sounds? Uh, I use this one. No, I use this one. Very good. That was dumb. What's this one say? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Huh. Alright. Uh why are you open? Why are you head in wall? Um no, your normal chest. Wouldn't that be fucked up if in the DLC they're like, I'm going to, we're, we're going to change the chain that's on a chest so the people that think that they can recognize a mimic on the fly aren't. And they're going to get fucked up. What was that dark orb? Is that the spell that they're casting? An abyss sorcery discovered by an Ulysseal sorcerer on the brink of madness. Fire giant dark orb. In contrast to the standard soul sorceries, abyss sorceries are weighty and inflict physical damage. Perhaps human souls, because of their humanity, produce sorceries with more tangible presence. Okay. Well, I'll test that out in a little bit. Uh, the end. I think. I guess. I guess we came down here for the sorcery. Wow, worth it. I know, right? They're amazing. They're such such good audio uh, audio things. Wait, didn't we drop down here? We did. Do I have to get back up? Yeah, there. Okay. Whoop. Hey, fella. How you doing? Eh. Get poked. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, oh, so we're just here. That's cool. Um, and then stairs, and then down. Perfect, perfect. Have you played through all the Souls games, Michelle? Or any particular ones? I can get onto that roof, but it's not really going to serve any purpose for me. Hello. Copper stab. G'day, Matt. Ow! You fuck! Oh, it's homing. I see. I see. Okay. Played a bit of two and three, never finished any. Don't find them fun, to be honest. That's fair. That's fair. It takes a certain amount of masochism to really, um, I don't know, sink your teeth into them, I guess. Hello.
You don't mind the suffering, just don't really like it. That's no, okay. Not everyone's cup of tea. It's very, it's very, um, at least the first one especially, is very bland looking as well. Um, most of it. The DLC is actually quite colourful in comparison, I suppose. Get stabbed. Get off me. Go away. What do I think about the first one so far? Um, I enjoy it. I like it. Um, yeah, it's good. It's good. Have fun with it. It's entertaining. It's challenging. Um, I played... Ha 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 ha. No, no, no. I played, um... A few souls likes before I decided to jump into this. Not me? Ah, oh, rude. I'm kidding, by the way. I'm always kidding. If I say something that's ever even remotely insulting, ah, it's probably a joke. Even if it really didn't sound like a joke at the time. Come on then. I think I've got more iced coffee around here actually. I should have the rest of that. Yeah, I stabbed that wall and he was so scared that he just died. See, my biggest problem is spots in the game like this, where you're in a situation where you kind of have to tank a little bit of damage. You have to sort of take a hit. And, um... Especially with a rickety bridge. I feel like he's going to be a problem. You can dodge. Oh, no, I know. I, you, I could roll under it. I could roll under it. For sure. Um... I might bank the level, actually. Save me from going further and further and further and further and further until I find the next bonfire. I'll bank the level. And then, um... We'll go punch him in the face. Sounds good. Might even have two. Nah, I don't have two. That's okay. Uh... Our decks. How short are we? 2,000? Basically. Where are you? Soul of a Proud Knight, you're 2,000 or you're 800? 2,000. Are we still short? Yes. By <laughs> 33 souls. I'm just going to go stab something. Hey fella, you're it. Perfect. Alright. Oh, hello. Uh, um, check out one of the decks. And... Is it... Probably, mm, may as well just do that too. Okay. Hello.
Come on. I probably should just aggro him and lead him up the stairs instead of shooting at him. Suck bomb, get stabbed. Come on, you two. Oh, I see. Do, 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 do. Dark Spirit starter box is invaded. Can we not? <sighs> I don't. I'm not interested. No, I'm not interested. Go away. I don't care if it counts as a win for you. That's cool. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not playing Invadey Boy right now. I know, a lot of people are going to be like, oh, Why didn't you just fight him? He could have killed you anyway. I'd be like, yeah, well, whatever. Like, it's, it's, it's faster. They want to invade and win. That's totally cool. I ain't got no interest in PvP right now. Are you all going to get aggroed if I get to the bottom of these stairs? Yeah. Oh no, just you two. That's good. People are like, you should just play offline. I'm like, eh. I like that it's a thing, but I kind of wish that you could sort of flip a switch <laughs> and have the good the good things and then get rid of the bad things. I guess it sounds cheesy. these titanite shards it's amazing i'm gonna stop for a second and just drink a bit of iced coffee because i feel like i'm zoning into this pretty hard and i think it's Whoa. i am awake brb too easy lana Oh, hello, that's right, that's the mage here. Forgot about you. <laughs> and that one's dead. And that one's dead. So I don't go human. That's, 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 that is purely the reason that I don't go human. Because I was human for like, what? Three seconds. And it's like, we've found you an enemy. I'm like, no, please. Come on then. Now, as for you, mage, what I am going to do, I'm going to cast this, and I'm just going to run at you with my shield up and hope for the best. Ow. Wait. Oh, I thought there was a bunch of mages over the other side. I was going to be really sad. 
There's one dude there. Is one on the right as well? No. Their eyes are all red and glowy when they're in the dark room. <laughs> Through the brick wall. Ooh, we're getting into like corrupted area again now. Well, something's going on over there. Rubbish. Lovely. No. Where did you fall down from there? Hmm. Okay. Laughing maniacally over there, buddy. Don't worry, I'm coming for you. Yo! You are back. Welcome back. There's a lot of you. Oh, and there's a mage. Bang. Yeah. No other mages being cheeky over there? No. Okay. Hello. Come on, whoever's following me, come up the stairs. Come on then, you three. Oh, that's bad. Ah, what? Damn you, shield finger. Come on. Get this over and done with quickly. Get down there. Smash out as much as we can. Come on, fellas. That's you boys. Up this way. Come on. Walkies. Come on. You guys too. Come on then. What are you doing? Getting my stab on. And you? And you also, friend? Perfecto! Stop trying to hit me and hit me! No, don't. I'm very squishy. Please don't hit me. I do like the sort of this, the city aspect of it, rather than like random outdoorsy shit. Like the whole ruined township thing is kind of cool. But then again, they're all ruined townships in the end, I guess. They don't laugh at me, just come over here. Nope, oh, this one. And we're gonna run at him again. Beautiful. Took a little bit of damage because it goes through my shield, but did it right. 
Dark Souls is a dance. It's a dance game. And I don't mean in the sense of like the old... Oh yes, sword play is a dance. I mean like in the sense of... There's very specific moves. And a time and it's like Dance Dance Revolution basically. Where you're like, I will do this and then that and then this and then that. Down a little bit further. Come down here. A little bit further. No. A little bit further. Yeah, there we go. Bang. <laughs> he's aggroed, but he's dumb. I can't shoot you there, bud. You probably know that. Come this way, then. Over here. Alright, well don't then. I'm just going to run over and aggro these boys. One of them, I guess. Get stabbed. Are you a secret? No. It's all up the top is just laughing repeatedly. He's having a great day. Who's out here on the stairs? No one? Okay. It's all over here. Eh? That's 10k. That's not bad. Sound like a spell. Oh shit. Yeah, okay. Wait, do you not have range? Why can't you hit me? What was it getting? What was it hitting? What are you hitting? Oh, I'm going to sneeze. Ooh, that was a big sneeze. I don't trust the fact. Hey, your spell's cutting off, and I don't know why. Um, oh shit. Oh yeah, now he hits me. Take one step forward. Um, I'm going to check what's up these stairs first. This is uh, a different way. Hey, 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 Hib. Welcome back, bud. How was doing real world stuff? Was it fun? Oh, that's okay. That's just going straight back down again. Keep an eye out for the mages because they'll just destroy me. They just will. Cold. Your little girl does kickboxing, but they have to do it outside, and it's four degrees. What? Four. So they have to do it outside because of the plague. Four degrees outside. Oof. Like I understand, exercise and physical activity is is you know going to keep you somewhat warm, but holy shit. What is he... Is he aggroed on the fucking furniture? What are you doing, bud? That's a mimic, too. Yep, back inside next week. Because you're dead good at vaccinating. <laughs> yeah. Burr, it's very cold. That's a yikes and a flex. 
Hello. Get stabbed. Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we're gonna do... He just hurt his fist. <laughs> Hello, RJ. Welcome back, bud. Can I lock onto your place? There we go. Oh, another? They moo. They moo when they die. Or like... They make like the sound of like a goat or some shit. They're all like... Mm -hmm. Which is the weirdest sound for a mimic to make. I mean... And not, not that I know exactly what sound a mimic would make, but like... I don't know. Is this out where the mage is? Well, the mage might even be below. Ladder. Yeah, that's where the mage is. Alright, I'm gonna poke my head out here. Let's drop it onto a roof. Is there a window to get in? No. It's just how to continue forward. Alright. I am going to try and deal with the mage first. So I'm going to do this. Probably going to lose a couple on the way down. Oh, no, wait. I'm fucking shooting at him from here. Hey, there's one. No. You're not allowed to shoot up here. Only I'm allowed to shoot down. Except my auto... What the fuck is that? Excuse me, sir? How was the Artorias fight? Um, I got my head smacked in repeatedly, and then... The light, like, I, it was probably... I don't know, what, four... Four deaths, and then on the fifth one I smashed him? Uh... Can do. Just gonna do this one more time. Like, why take the chance and have to start from all the way back up at the fucking top? Go on. Is that it? Is that him? The fuck smell is that? That's insane. It sounds weird. Okay. Climb down. No funny business. Uh, pretty sure there's three of these dudes down here. Why take the chance, he says. You'll have to start back up the top, he says. When he's contemplating on how to fall on these guys. Nope, okay. Ow, 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 ow. Roll away, please. Roll away. Yeah, Lana missed it. She was here for all of the deaths, and then she got up for a second and walked away and missed it. It was very quick. It was a very quick murder. Uh, so... I'm going to go back up. And I'm going to go out that door onto the roof. Because it seems that I can always drop down to the ground. So many stairs. Such an roundabout way to get to where I want to be. Oh wait, there's another room over here. I forgot. Try light. Oh yeah, it's making that noise again. That dumb. But the other one was. I don't know. And the roll? And keep running. Why is that fire lit? Why is why is this fire lit? None of the other fires in this whole place are lit. 
like, no, 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 light that one. It's like, but what about all the other ones? Nah, fuck them. Only that one. Something up and around here, maybe? Oh, something. Twin humanities? Hey, I'll take it. Hey. Hmm, everything is very blue, dubba dee dubba die. Try eliminating one at a time. Ooh, this takes me back up. Please be a shortcut. Please be back to that upstairs. Yes, it is. Wicked. But we're gonna kindle. Did I kill Artorius already? Yeah, I smashed him. He smashed me repeatedly first, but then I smashed him. So I can kindle again? I would expect I would be able to. I think that's what that is. He's one of them, yes. Um, he's a very quick boy. He's very roly-poly. He's a very... What? No, I'm fucking at the bonfire. Do not invade me right now. Are you serious? Ugh. But I'm... I'm fucking kindling, you dick. No, fuck off. Go away. Go away. Hmm. He's smashing me. Good. Glad that happened. You can't even fucking kindle that bonfires. I stopped to use another humanity. Literally standing at the fucking bonfire to use another humanity. And people are just invading. It's like, come the fuck on, just let me do my thing. And now I've got to use another fucking humanity. <sighs> this is, this is legit, like... Mm. Does my head in. Like, at least have your bonfires as like fucking safe zones, come on. I'm going to get invaded again as soon as I stand up. I know it. <sighs> you left to have dinner and you killed him. Yeah, he was, he was before. He was earlier on. Who the hell's still invading in this game? I don't know, man. People still love it. <sighs> what I'm going to do is I'm going to stand up. And put on homing crystal soul mass. Are you gonna are you gonna go out? Like basically immediately? No? No, you're gonna give me plenty of time this time? Oh good. I've got a feeling that this is just like a super popular PvP zone, to be honest. Invading is one of the things that really got you to dislike Dark Souls. Yeah, it's, it's generally why I don't go human. Like, I know a lot of people get a real kick out of it. I know a lot of people really love the PvP. That's totally cool. I'm not shitting on the fact that the PvP is there. I just... I would prefer that... <laughs> I would prefer that I didn't have to opt in to PvP. To random PvP. 
every time I want to upgrade a bonfire. Because it's 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 a little bit it's a little bit silly. It's like imagine if in any other game you go to you know you go to the your NPC that uh, that sells health packs and stuff and is like okay but you got to queue up for a PvP match first and you're sort of like why oh good well didn't have to be killed by PvP for that anyway not to mention the PvP can be quite broken. You got people that didn't move at all but killed you for no, for no apparent reason. That's rough. Why don't I play offline? Uh, yeah, I know. I know. And uh, people people say that. People are like, you should just play offline. I don't, I don't want to have to. Because there are obviously other benefits to playing online. And... Like, I don't know. It just, it seems, it seems like there's like... Mm. Like for such a PvE heavy game, I don't know, again, I know the PvP has a big following and a lot of people love it and that's cool. Um, just very few games force you to PvP when you don't want to. It's not a it's not a big issue. I just don't go human. There was a case of the item drop that banned people for hacking. Needing to play offline is such a band aid solution. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I, there's. Mm. Especially if you like, like my character. I don't know how well I would go in PvP. I don't think very well. I know that I'm very squishy. The couple of fights that I have had, especially early on, were sort of... I got destroyed. But, um... I don't know. I don't know. It's just interesting. I feel, I feel like there's a better solution somewhere. Oh, hey. Excuse me? Since when do you ever do that? You're with you, you hate invading too. You've restarted your PS4 mid-invasion to avoid death. The five minute reboot was better than dying. Yeah. And the fact that people do that. Not even for like, not even with malicious intent. It's not like you're turning it off to fucking dupe items or anything crazy like that. Like, it's not that kind of game. But, like... Ah. <sighs> It's, it's, I sp it's, it's, it's funny. It's, it's dumb. I feel like there's a better solution. I feel there's a better way, a better way to do it. Maybe there's a, you know, there's all these different items in the game that make it so that you can PvP. I feel that people that put humanities on are almost just like the victims. You have all these different PvP things that you can use to invade people for different reasons. <laughs> and a whole mate that uses a humanity is just like, oh, look, I look like a person now, that's good. And then just gets destroyed. And he's like, I don't understand. If we're going to play Dark Souls 3, there's a couple of Covenant trophies that demand loads of PvP. It's a nightmare. <sighs> Where the fuck was the mage? Oh, they're on the stairs over there. Right, right, right. Fair enough. Oh, I nearly rolled off the edge anyway. Stupid. Oh. You're coming? You're coming this way. Okay. Uh sure. I'm 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 cool with that. Probably. Where are you, mage? 
No, that's going to hit the stairs. You're dumb. Don't laugh. You're dead. The fuck? What even? Um, get stabbed? You end up using the Dark Souls subreddit to find a friend so that you take turns killing each other for PvP drops? Oof. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I understand having PvP specific challenges and shit. Like, achievements are supposed to be something to be achieved. But, I don't know. I, I, feel, I feel Dark Souls is not a a PvP game. There's probably some hardcore PvPers that just cried blasphemy, but just it's it's to me the Souls games, all of them are are PVE, in my opinion. They just have PvP there as well. I don't know a lot of effort went into setting it up and balancing it and whatever. It's just not it's not a PvP game for me. I don't like being pushed into PvPing whenever I want to upgrade my bonfires. Hmm. Hmm. I see. You are different. If this room's full of mages, I'm probably fucked. No? Pretty big fucking room. Is there anything over in the corners here? Nothing cheeky? It's a night- the nightmare was farming wolf's blood sword grass for hours and hours and hours straight. That's one of them. Those guru things on the bridge. Oh, the guru things on the bridge. You find it strange that the PvP is on the invader's terms. Especially when the game is released. Yeah. What's a brilliant PvP based trophy is the one where you have to help people do bosses. The Sunlight Covenant. PV a PV PvE based trophy? You mean? I've never had the time to play beforehand. Can easily farm new players that are not using a PvP build. Like me for instance. Yeah. Yeah. Hello. I don't know what you are. But you're dead. So there's that. Nice. I love a good pair of pants. What's this note? Need head. Guys. It's with other people, but working together. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, for doing the whole, like... Solaire! Jolly cooperation, etc. What's this? Uh, oh shit, hello. Didn't expect somebody to be on the lift. The ones on the bridge. Praise the sun. Braze the sun indeed. Oh, this way. Is that a bonfire? Oh, baby, it is. Uh, it's in the. It's a very dark bonfire, so I'm just gonna do this real quick. Because if we make it to the other end, it's not gonna matter. Everything be rumbling. There's the other covenant grind in redacted so as not to spoil going up the stairs. Um, I feel like I shouldn't have kindled that other bonfire now after all that bullshit. Because now we're at a new one! Yay! <laughs> Let's chuck another point in decks. Oh, now we're in a cave. Okay. Cool. 
good old Dark Souls cave. There's a lot of lights down there, and they're all very far down. Wow. They are very far away. Chasm of the Abyss. Isn't that the same thing twice? Suck shit, lizard. You just got fucked up. I didn't even do it on purpose. Isn't it, isn't a chasm, like a chasm is obviously like a ravine, but an abyss is a, like a very deep, bottomless, so at sometimes, type of thing. Sorry bud, didn't mean to shoot with all five. No mage, no. You go away. I'm going to die. I have a little sippy. <sighs> Dark Souls 3 has a wonderful area reveal surprise if you don't already know it. Uh, I don't. I don't. I don't. I like, like, I know the rough storyline to most of the Dark Souls games. Um, but I've only really played... I haven't played any of two. I've probably played maybe an hour of three. But one was the one that I got up to Nito and, and all that sort of stuff. Like, I knew of Seath, and I knew that he kills you because I had gone into the room where he kills you automatically at the start. But then... um. I didn't know that he also had uh, a second place where you actually fight him. Like, I didn't even know the Crystal Caves existed. Didn't know they were a thing. What? Happiness? Why happiness? Dark Bead. Well, what is Dark Bead? I am curious. Do those homing crystals just fire off automatically when you lock on? Ah, uh, not even when you lock on. Not even when you lock on. They just shoot shit. It's got to be in front of you from what, I've, what I can gather. Like within a certain... Um, within a certain like arc or angle in front of you. Uh, so if you have your back to something. Um... But yeah, and they have better range than my lock-on for a lot of enemies, which is awesome. Oh, hello. Be gone. Nothing over here, this is just your shitty spawn point. You're supposed to stab people in the back? Great. You should do, you should do a mage build. Oh. Oh. Are they, like, giant humanities? What the fuck? Humanity. Yeah, thanks, genius. Huh. Interesting. There's, like, a whole bunch of them. Oh, apparently they're enemies. I think. No, that's not me locking onto them. Oh, yes, it is. Can I shoot you? Phew! I can, and I don't even kill you with one shot. Fascinating. Huh. I don't know all the smoky shooters on the left either. Hello. If I kill you, do I get humanities from you? That'd be handy. I can kill the little ones in one shot. I feel like... 
I feel like there's too many to kill them all like that. Also, many of them are aggroed now. Oh no, you just go back down the bottom, that's alright. The lore about the Abyss and the Furtive Pygmy, etc. baffles you. Yeah, I know a little bit about it, but I didn't know there would be, you know, humanity ghosts, whatever the fuck they are. Um, it's interesting nonetheless, I guess. Hey, guys. No, don't get that one. Get that one. Do it. What are you doing? Is your attack just chilling? Can I kill you in one hit, maybe? Oh, ow, ow, that dealt me damage. How rude. And it took away my humanity. I think. You're a prick. They just sort of hang out and look at you, it's weird. The humanity dropped a humanity. How fitting. It's the little ones I can kind of stab to death. Hey, bud. You want to get stabbed? Get stabbed. Oh! Oh, it's just touching him. Oh, God! Oh, God! That's death? Very quickly. Interesting. So they just basically, like... They don't even really attack, they just fly into you and you're fucked. That's kind of cool, and also kind of shit, but also kind of cool. Fascinating. Alright. I'm gonna go down there and I'm gonna fuck them up. Hello? Yeah. Bam. Because the Furtive Pygmy found the Dark Soul. But like... Before there was the Dark... He just fell through the ground. Before there was the Dark Soul... Or before there was... Before the Great Flame existed, there was nothing. That's basically the premise from what I understand. And then... Nido, Nido got death. Uh... The Queen of... Queen? The Witch of Isleth got... Um... The little one killed me, I can't believe that. Fascinating. They've got to be... They've got to be a decent range away. Uh, that was the wrong spell to use on him from this range. Ugh, ugh. At least they're not particularly quick, I suppose. So many of them, though. Oh, no, he's already dead. Oh, shit! Fuck you, stupid mage. You gonna come over here? You gonna make that mistake? Alright. Have a little sippy.
Ugh. There's levels to this shit. Shoot him. Shoot him. Spell. What, is it too vertical for you? Fine. Fuck it then. We'll go shoot someone else. See if I care. And also, you can drop down to the left here. There's like smoky shit. I don't know what that is. So I can... Oh, that's fake. Fun. Oh, cat. Hello, cat. Oh. Goodbye, cat. Oh no, you're still here. Hello, cat. Goodbye again, cat. Ramp down that goes further. What is this? Imminent happiness? Oh. Where the fuck did you just come from? I did not even see you. Are you a shortcut, maybe? Whoa, it's a lot of up. Is this back at the thing? <gasps> That's the other lift. Hey! Awesome. Awesome. That's one hell of a shortcut. Fuck yeah. And that's our, um... a good bonfire in the corner here too. So it should be... Who are you? you. Hello. Is that not the soul of the man who fell on this spot? He was a dear friend. I wish to pay proper respect with that soul. Would you be willing to part with it? Ah, uh, sure. Thank you. You are very kind. Please take this. I no longer need it. Huh. May the Lord guide thee. Thanks to the random daggers. It's useless, May but alright. That's all you're going to say from now on. Okie dokie. Enjoy the soul. Don't get weird with it. Please don't get weird with it. Oh, actually, that reminds me. We got a key from way down there. I can't even remember exactly what it was called. But the key might be the key that opens the door up up here? Maybe? Spoiler, she gets weird with it. Oh, I can I can tell. Like, she's like, I don't need these daggers anymore. I got something better. Not going to elaborate on that at all. It sounds like a trap is in here. Sounds like spinning blades or something. Hello? Oh, you're big. Uh, you look kind of blacksmithy though. Hello. Mm. Hi. A visitor have we? Thou must be the one who freed Artorias. An old friend he was. Thanks to thee. He left this world with honor intact, and here I am, retired and blind. A little help to thee, I'm afraid. Okay, Michelle, enjoy your luck. Always appreciated, my friend. Stung piles, homeward bones. Oh, they're so much cheaper from this dude. Whatever. Hello, carving. Thank you, carving. 
They're very cheap too. I mean, I'm not. I got nothing against them. It's his voice being weird. He's got shards. He's got Goff's great arrow. Cool. Gardens shall never be forgotten. We knights yeah. fought valiantly, but for every one of them, we lost three score of our own. Exhilaration, pride, hatred, rage. The dragons teased out our dearest emotions. Thou will understand one day. With our twilight, old thoughts return, and great waves of nostalgia. Me? Okay. There's very little to be said. What good is a dog with no hairs to hunt? But I'm lucky to be alive, I suppose. Me? Yeah, that's true. What good is... But I'm lucky... Farewell, human. Lead thy life. As thou seest fit. Okay. Um. Tomorrow, is the black dragon posing the duress? Yes. Yes. I thought as much. He's called Calamit. A ferocious dragon indeed. Even mighty Anna Londa dared not provoke his ire. I see little good coming from this. My intent is to persevere to the bitter end. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yep. <laughs> good, good. What is bravery without a dash of recklessness? I've Indeed. I've taken a liking to thee, and I owe thee much for thy service to Artorius. Now, watch and see how Goth Dragons. Okay. Oh, that's your bow. That's a big bow. That's a big bow. Suck shit, dickhead! <laughs> Gonna come down there and put my sword in your yes. bum. A true shot was never loosed. That bat will be grounded for a good spell. The rest is in thine hands. I await good tidings. Ah. Cool. Dragon slaying. Knighthood's highest calling. Wait, kid. That was cool. Hib says, do you have a natural ability with these kinds of games? I've seen you play this and the Surge and you never get lost. And you seem to be able to put all the puzzles together. I, I just grew up enjoying, um, you know, a lot of games like Legend of Zelda and, um, you know, things like that, I guess. Um, I get lost in places like that are very samey, but I'm, I'm very landmark based. So if I'm in a room that is relatively generic and there's four identical looking doors, I'll get lost. Um, but I don't know. I appreciate the compliment. You say anything else? Hello there. What of Calamite? He is an ancient dragon. Sky would I know. He will not be put down easily. Okay. Me? But I'm... Farewell, human. 
See you, buddy. I like you. It's pretty cool. I think as far as not getting lost and as far as being able to put the puzzles together, I feel like that's more um, that's more to to the that's more to the game developers because there are definitely some games out there where they're just not telegraphed well, I suppose. Um, Like, one game that was a bit dicky about that would be, um... One game that was a bit dicky about that was the, uh... What was it called? Fuck, what did I play after Surge? Um... Lords of the Fallen. Lords of the Fallen was... Playable? <laughs> I think that's... I'm trying to find a really nice way to put it. It was, it was playable, but there were definitely parts of it where it's like, Do this! And it just doesn't... It doesn't give you anything. Um, and you have, like, objectives and little mini-quests and all sorts of stuff. And it'll be like, hey, this is this. is this." But, also... It just would be like, go and kill the thing. And you get there, and there's these doors that have these symbols on them, and you can't do anything about it. And it's not the kind of symbol that you're like... Oh, this is obviously a door that I'm going to come back to and open later. It doesn't say this is locked or anything. There's just this weird glyph on the wall. And you're like, I, I can't do anything about that. So you spend too long doing that. When you find out later on, it's just an NPC that flips a switch later on and goes, Oh yeah, everything's cool. You would not have liked people to watch your first playthrough of this. That said, this mage build is super OP. Oh yeah, it is. It is. I understand. I understand I'm, I'm quite broken. Um, but... I mean, I'm not min-maxing. I'm far from min-maxing. I'm just sort of playing with what's here. I'm sure if somebody turned around and asked, if I asked someone, like, how do I how do I make the most broken mage ever? They'd list off some of the stuff that I've got, and then they'd be like, also, put points into this, and put points into that, and use this spell, and I'm just like, I'm just using what I like, and what sort of feels good and powerful, I suppose. And it's working. You think all mage builds are super OP from what you've read? I don't know. I don't know. I think my squishiness is definitely um, quite rough. Come on, fellas. There we go. You're really looking forward to do it? Yeah, well, I mean... Oh, I've gone the wrong way. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I don't know why I'm walking back down this way. Too busy just yammering on. Alright, Hib, enjoy your luck. I will be around. We are kind of coming to the end of things. But I, I should be around for at least a little bit longer. Royal Wood. And then the elevator. That goes down 500 miles to the bottom. Shoot the one that moves first, I guess. Pew, pew, pew. So that's imminent happiness. I'm guessing because of the lift, but I don't know why it's here and not at the lift. Haha! -ha. If 
fuck is that? That's a little bit of a waste. Get deaded, humanity. Hello, puppy. Hello. Oh, goodbye. The Cleansing Great Shield. Which is Artorias' shield. It's very, 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 very fucking heavy. None of those guys are using fire or lightning, so I should probably equip that to be fair. Um, it's going to block more of that magic damage from those mages, I think. But yeah, Artorias is great shield. A cleansing great shield. It is still great shield used by the knight Artorias, who succumbed to the abyss, unfortunately. Artorias, deeply scarred by the abyss, used this to form a barrier to protect his compatriot Sif. Although this drained the shield, the magic defense remains high. It does, it certainly does. No, don't unequip it. You fuck. I had that equipped. It was worth five. This one's only worth three. Put it on. Good shit. What's my weight? 17.5 out of 55. It's well over a quarter. It's well over a quarter. This is just bottomless pit over here. Okay. Well, we met Sif. So that's good. Chuck this on. That is the edge of the abyss. Uh, this is more edge of the abyss. The abyss. I feel like that one humanity up there needs to die because I don't know if they can drop off shit. They can. Another path back up. Sound. I hear noises. Oh, hey. You're fucking dead, aren't you? What are you shooting at? Oh, this is where he was before. Huh. I'll take that humanity. Thank you very much. Good, sir. I can hear like a doom, 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 doom sort of sound. Big one. When they all take two shots. Oh, he takes three because he's big, big. going they're all very like I don't know if they have like a bunch of different sizes or if it's just the three 
I need, I need to know what Black Flame is. The pyromancy discovered from the Dark of the Abyss by a pyromancer who wandered into Ulysseal. Conjure a great black flame in one's palm. Black flames are weighty and inflict physical damage. Enough to smack away the mightiest of shields. That's kind of cool. Uh, yeah, there's just nothingness, but there's something over there. But there's no, uh, no edge on this cliff. I don't know, maybe, do you think the darkness was maybe like a, something that was put in place originally because it was sort of like, oh, well, the draw distance is a bit lacking. Path ahead, okay. All right. Treasure! Twin Humanities. Yeah, sure. Why not? That's another Kindled Bonfire. Um. Oh, hello. He's still fucking hurt, though. White Titanite Slab, sure. Ooh, drop down, boss gate. What is further up here? Is there... Nah, fuck it. I'm just gonna shoot ya. They both drop in humanities. Hey, nice. Soul of a hero, that's another 10k. Jumping. No! No, no jumping. Don't be a shit. Okay. Alright. <clears throat> we'll have a little sippy. Let's go in and see what's on the other side of the gate. That's what brought me here. Oh. Oh. Oh, he's big. Um. It's a big boy. What you doing? Oh, even even big spell does not much to you, does it, huh? That's much pain. Oh, he has big arms, too. What the 
the fuck? Oh, he grabbed me. Is that what he did? I was like, I can't even see my character anymore. Okay, so I hit him with three crystal soul spears, which is the strongest, and it took off two fifths of his health, I guess. I suppose. Now. I wonder. I wonder if I can. I wonder if I can uh, crack a humanity. Get the fuck out of here quickly. Hopefully, I don't get fucking invaded. I'm a running. I mean, I suppose I could probably still get invaded here because the dragon's alive. Well, the dragon's not like. I mean, Artorius is dead. I suppose he would be the boss of this foresty area. The Royale Wood. But when I get down there, I can probably get invaded. Which is going to be annoying as fuck. Oh, lift you so fast. Uh, oh, hey. They don't give much in the way of souls, which is... Oh. See ya. Let's try and make our way down there relatively quickly, hey? We go up and around, yeah? think? No. Yes. Yes, we do. Because we're going to go up here and then... Oh, hey! Yeah, I remembered you as I rounded that corner. And then we can go down this. Which is good. And then through here... Uh, then we can drop down. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Keep on running. I don't have full health, which is going to be annoying. Hm. Well, already fucked. And I'm dead. <laughs> That was quick. Good use of a humanity. There's a summoning sigil right there. Why is there a summoning sigil in the fire in the boss fire room? Like, is that real? Like, are they serious right there? He does like a big, like a big old swing with, I guess, what is his right hand. <laughs> no, please. Uh, 
Let me go this way. So he's got a lot of health. Oh, hey. I actually forgot about you that time. Um. Traverse the white light. That's me dead again, pretty much. Yep. Can't get up quick enough. <sighs> that's okay. That's okay. here and walk back? I'm, I'm guessing I can. LaSalle Township Dungeon or LaSalle Sanctuary. Uh. I'm gonna head back to Fight Lake Shrine. I will come back here, we are going to continue, but I just want to, um, uh, so we've got a couple of different spells that we might be able to use instead of what we currently have. So we got, um... Why well, Dragon Breath it takes three days to cast? Magic Shield, Strong Magic Shield, Decoy, Hush, Fall, Repair, Chameleon, Remedy. Secure Dark Orb, Dark Bead, Dark Fog. An Abyss Sorcery discovered in all soil. Red Cloud, Dark Fog. Although Dark Fog is in theory relatively close to humanity, it also happens to be a terrible poison for humans. Perhaps it reflects man's cruelty against his own. A okay, dark bead. In contrast, the standard soul sorceries of sorceries are waiting to inflict physical damage. Perhaps a human soul is closer to matter than its humanity. Okay. Well, just for... for testing's sake. Dark bead. No, no, no. no. Orb. Uh, and then here we're going to put on uh, Great Soul Arrow. And then we're going to test it on some poor gun up the hill. So this guy, Great Solaro, is currently doing 459. 453. 459, 453, so four, say 450. 459 again, yep. As expected. Don't even dodge. Just cop the hit. Crystal Soul Mass, how much you doing to one dude? 343. Funnily enough, not as much. I say 450-ish for those. And then we've got Dark Fog. 
which is a not a pyromancy, I guess. What is what's that? Is it like a big? Huh? Did that even do anything? Oh, that's what that is. Does it hurt me? No. Okay. And then dark bead. Is dark bead basically? Oh, no, that's not. What is that? Oh, there's a drop to them. Seven hits though. But it's basically a shotgun by the looks of it. So you want to be really close to shit, which I don't like. It's quick though. Could be handy. He's big too. So I don't have to be super, super close. Hmm. One of those is almost doing as much damage as, as the other thing. Can you come down here, please? Thank you, sir. This way. Come on. Now give me a hit so I can stagger you. Hmm. Maybe it's good for, like, swarms of enemies. If I target him, is it going to guaranteed hit? Yeah. It's not as much damage. It's not as much damage. Oh yeah, and Dark Orb. I got 12 of them. Uh, what kind of damage is Dark Orb doing? Taking 3 days to cast. 672. That's like 1400. Yeah, the, the spear is better. You get more of the orbs, but the spear is better. Okay. Um. I guess the Ulsar Township one is the one that we want to be at. shoot our magic before we go down there with all the wrong stuff equipped too. Alright. So, let's grab ourselves. Great tall arrow. I don't think we need a ton of them. Uh, have a crystal soul mass. Can go last. Soul Spear, Soul Spear, Crystal Soul Spear. I don't feel like any of these other spells are going to help me. Like Dark Bead, maybe. I only get six uses out of it, but... I don't know, maybe it does bulk damage to him, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Uh, let's put him here, Homing Crystal Soul Mast. And I guess... I guess Grey Toll Arrow anyway. <sighs> oh, she's gone. I think we're going to have, because it is 5am here, nearly, practically. We have been going for quite a while, overall, nearly 9 hours. Back again, perfect timing. Ah, no. Have I done Calamite yet? No, 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 no. Not yet. Shot him down, but I uh he can he can wait. I'll let him bleed out a little bit on the ground. 
Ah, that's right behind me, and I didn't expect it to be. <laughs> Alright, haven't seen him use that before. Fair enough. The one time that I 100% remember that he's around that corner and he just goes, Nah, you're dead. <sighs> Such is the way of eight resilience and relatively light armor. But I can feel myself, like, my reaction time is getting slower. Um, and, and like, it's that, it's that sort of, it's that sort of, uh, time of the day where we're, uh, we're not sort of absorbing any of the knowledge that we're, we're learning from fights and shit. So, I think I'm gonna have one more run at him. If we get lucky, we get lucky. Um... But I think I have one more one more run at this dude at Manus. And then I think I will go and have a look down and see what the dragon's got going on. Hello. You heard it say, eat this dickhead just before that blast. Yeah, I, I heard something like it. Ulasol catalyst. Um Everyday Ulusile Sorcery Catalyst. Formed by several enchanted branches. Boost sorcery adjustment. But lost land sorceries are not offensive. And attacks are not boosted by intelligence. Wait, what? Lost land sorceries are not offensive. What do you mean? What do you mean lost land sorceries are not offensive? Even is lost, what, lost land sorceries. I'm guessing that's Ula Seal. But what do you mean they're not offensive? They look pretty offensive to me. Maybe it means they're not going to swear at me? They're not going to tell me I'm a dickhead? That's pretty unoffensive. Maybe lost land sorceries are now wholesome. And we go, uh, drop, and a drop, and a run, and a drink, and I go through the door. This is going to be over very, very quickly, because I don't, I don't really know his attacks yet. It's funny, because the first go was the one that I stayed alive the longest. But we'll go check out Calamite in a sec. One way or another. Hello. I love you. Not a good roll. And that was not a good dodge, because that was a different attack. And my Crystal Soul Spear took off, what, like an eighth of his health, maybe? I've only got four of them. So I went squish. But that's okay. We will beat him when we're feeling a little bit quicker as far as brain power is concerned. We'll be able to get him, though. I have no fear of that. He's... In the grand scheme of things, he has big windows. Like, big damage windows by the looks of it. Uh, 
I get down to there again? Down this way, isn't it? I think. I believe so. Oh, that's up. I want to go down. Oh, just the path over there. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I've been muted. See, that's the thing. I'm not even picking up whether I'm muted or not. Albatross cooked. I haven't eaten today. Or I haven't eaten since I started streaming. I really should have. But, um... Albatross cooked this... this slow cooked this meal. Did a whole bunch of stuff and all that sort of thing. Like, no, it wasn't like a meal that was like supposed to be some sort of romantic dinner or anything, but... What are you doing? Are you Okay. You right, buddy? Oh, yeah, you good? Okay, that's good. I was worried for a second there. He had brain worms. Ah, now there's a fog gate. I see. You want to call? It's fine by me. It's Real Madrid versus Liverpool now, anyway. Yeah, that's too easy. I still want to check out Calamite. I'm going to check out Calamite, and then, you know, we'll see what, what, uh, what he's got going on. And, um... We will probably wrap things for the day. But we'll, we'll suss it out first. See what he's doing. Um, where is where is Danliness? This one. Hello? Looks like he filled the whole area with fire, like... Hello? Uh oh. <laughs> did we even hit him with that spell? I thought we did. I guess not. I need, to, I need to see if I can hit him with the spell. Crystal Soul Spear. If we can hit him with Crystal Soul Spear, maybe unless he's immune to magic. Oh, Jesus. You had untold issues with that dragon? Like, bugginess? Or just... He was just a tough fight? Because I hold... I, I expect it to be a tough fight. Because I kind of... I feel like he's optional. And usually the optional bosses in these games are the tougher ones. Nah, just dead hard, even with a strength build. Doggo! Hello! He's optional and DLC, yeah. Like, his breath attacks don't seem like all that in a bag of potato chips. He seemed very slow. But, um, they are definitely beefy. There's an optional dragon in Dark Souls 3, and it's the hardest boss in any From, any From Software game, in your opinion. I look forward to encountering it at some point in my future. <laughs> That said, we can always grab a humanity and come down here too. See if there's any uh, friendly souls that want to help us. There was, um... The summoning sigil. 
in the Manus boss fight is inside the Manus room. Like, what the fuck? Uh, hello? Mr. Dragon, sir? Oh, there he is. Hey, buddy. Hello. No, 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 no. Don't take off. Nah, I don't like flying. Drink. Move. Roll away. Scapa. That's big slams. What is that? Is that death beam? I don't know what you're doing. Let me roll away, please. Drink. 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 Roll away. Ah, no. Ah, ah. Roll away again. No, don't do that. That's bad. And he's still going, so it's going to hit me again. No. Drink, drink. No, don't hit me. Ow. Roll away. Can you fuck off for a minute, please? Just, please, just give me a second. Get out of my face. You know what? I think I know how to fuck him up. Drink it, drink it, drink it, drink it, dead. Yep. Yeah. I think I know how, to, how we can fuck him up, though. I've got a plan for him. With him being all up in my grill. I reckon we can do a nice big... Uh, well, I've got a couple options, actually. I've got, like, that shotgun blast spell. And I've got... Um, I can do, like, a big nasty... Uh, like, a fog. Or something as well. Which could be very, very cool. Very, very exciting. Um... Don't be ashamed to use the summon. It's not a sign of weakness. You won't judge me. No, no, no. Of course not. I like. I have. I have no. I have no qualms in using a summon. I like to. I like to give the boss a go myself, beforehand, just to see if I can. Um, but you know, if I need to, I'll use a summon. And an NPC summon isn't isn't terrible either. NPC summons aren't bad. The only problem with the only reason. And this sort of stems into the conversation we were having before. The only thing that I have against summons is that you have to opt into PvP to use them. <laughs> oh, but yeah, but they can't PvP you if the boss of the zone's dead. What the fuck do I need a summon for if the boss of the zone's dead anyway? <sighs> but it is what it is. We've got some stuff, actually. We've got some bits and pieces. We have rubbish. Yay. We've got a bunch of humanities. A guardian soul. Probably turn that into something. Ooh, actually, firekeeper soul. I'll do that before I log out or I'll forget. That you have agreed to link the fire. I thank you sincerely. Yep, yep. You're Finally, welcome. The curse of the undead will be lifted. And I can die human. I am powerless. But I will do all that I can. Please, save us all. Please. Okay. Esther's flask reinforced. Yeah, it is. Okay, cool. Not that I need to do any of that at all anymore. Because my Estus refills my health fully. So I don't think reinforcing it is... Necessary? Uh, we got rubbish, we got twin humanities, guardian soul. That's 40,000 there. There's a bunch, we got a bunch of, of souls just building up here. We got a bunch of carvings that say things. We bought a whole bunch of transient curses when we really didn't need them. Um, um, we got a bunch of things. We did, we did. Necessary? And nest nest necessary? And and necessary? Oh necessary. Ha 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 that was a real stretch. Come on. That was a real stretch. Curved sword used by Lord's Blade, Syrian. Oh, 
Kieran? Kieran? Siren? Anyway. She brandishes a sword in a mesmerizing dance, etching the darkness with dire streaks of gold. The victim is first distracted by dazzling streaks of the gold tracer, then stung by the vicious poison of this dagger. Cool. Excellent. Uh, no, no, no. I'm going to... Ah. Now we're going to... Get rid of the dagger. I'm going to get rid of... The other dagger. Need the heavy crossbow. Don't need the Ulusoil Catalyst because it's garbage. Uh, I'll keep any shields on me for now. Put those in storage. We don't have these on us, which we need. Chain leggings. Chainmail leggings of thin interlinking rings of steel. You love the word necessary? <laughs> necessary? Is it necessary for me to drink my own urine? No, but I do anyway, because it's sterile and I like the taste. Yeah, I love that movie. It is common throughout the human world, since it can be easily produced. It's not too heavy and offers good defense. Not my favor flashy armor, but for warriors on the battlefield, anything is fine as long as it keeps them alive. Um, I don't think we picked up anything else, did we? Oh yeah, we did. Guardian said. Um, uh, so much armor that we own. Grandmaster stuff. That. Sage robes, traveling gloves. Nothing else? Chain leggings can go away as well. Can we reinforce any of our stuff? We do. We have items for them to reinforce them. So I just need a handful of souls. What's the cheapest? What's the cheapest soul that we've got? Off topic. Why don't I have more channel emojis? Uh, because I don't. So the way that Twitch works. So I'm an affiliate. I'm not a partner. So first off, I can only get. A maximum of seven um, but normal subscriptions only I can only get a maximum of five and when you get them you get you have your first emote there like right from the beginning you get one basically and then when you get to the 10 sub mark you get your second one and then after that I think it's I think it's 25 or 15, 25, 35. I can't remember the actual layout, but basically once you have a certain number of subs, um, you will unlock more and more emotes um, at any given time. So the more subs that you get concurrently, the more subs you, uh, the more emotes you'll unlock. And you don't lose those emotes once they're unlocked, of course. But yeah, that's basically how it works. Um, and the emotes that I've got at the moment are kind of a work in progress anyway, so it is what it is. Uh, what is the cheapest soul that I've got? Large soul of an aimless soldier. It's like 800, yeah? 1,000. Fair enough. 1,000's good. Uh, no. Reinforce armor. No. Reinforce armor. Okay. We'll repair everything so we don't need to next time. Um. Oh, I have 20 Estus here? Huh. Interesting. Subs or followers? Subs. Subs. So there's a lot of different like tick boxes to unlock affiliate to start with. Um, one of which is hitting 50 followers, and then once you hit 50 followers, um, the number of followers don't effectively matter for anything anymore. So, you know, hypothetically, if you wanted, I don't know, 107 followers, such a fucking random number, 
That was so random. I don't know why that was... But anyway. 107 followers. There's no real purpose to it, specifically. Um, because all, all Twitch cares about is is that first sort of 50. Once you have 50 and then there's a few other tick boxes for that, they're like, okay, cool. Um, 107 is the magic number. Yeah, it must be. Um, once you hit 50, then you have... Uh, it's like stream for a certain number of hours and stream a certain number of days in a month and there's, there's something else as well. I can't remember what the fourth thing is. But you tick these boxes and then they go... Um, you know, they send you the the invitation to become affiliate and then you fill out a whole bunch of paperwork and you give them all your tax information and all this sort of shit. And then they go, okay, cool. We will let you have emotes and let people sub to you and shit and channel points and whatever else. It's like, okay, cool. And then after that, like partner is the next step and partner is like oh yeah that's right affiliate the, the fourth thing for affiliate is to have an average of three concurrent viewers um over a month for every every session that you have which can be a little bit tough in the beginning especially for like exposure to, to sort of get found um and then partner is the same sort of thing except it doesn't matter about followers it's, it's about like streaming for a certain number of hours and a certain number of days and having an average of 75 viewers. So it's a big jump for three, 3 and 75. That's when Twitch gives you $3,000. Yeah. Yeah, that must be it. Uh, hello, truck. You are very loud this morning. Oh, your God, really? Yeah. To be able to have emotes, to be able to have, have subs, and even channel points. So the channel points that are down the bottom, that let you, like, do stuff, like hydrate and shit, that doesn't exist for unless you're an affiliate. Which is a shame, in my opinion, but... You know, there's bots if you want to play games and stuff. <sighs> 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 I'm tired. Um, well, I'm probably going to go. You never thought of the tax stuff? You bet UK streamers will have to pay income tax on it too? Oh, everyone does. That's the whole That's the whole tax stuff. We do here. And the catch is, this is, this is the real kicker, um, because Amazon is a US-based company, when, uh, when someone subscribes, they subscribe to, they, they pay Amazon, basically. Um, and then Amazon takes its cut. And then Amazon pays whoever is streaming a, a certain percentage of the uh, of the sub. Now, because it's a, a, a US-based company living in Australia, it gets taxed in the US. So it gets taxed there. So Amazon takes their cut. And then the American tax agency takes their cut and then when it gets the whatever is left is sent through to me then there's income tax in Australia on top of it which is awesome but um, that's why you'll see a lot of people that'll be like oh you know when you really get into it and you start getting you know however many people watching and all that sort of stuff you gotta look at like um, you gotta look at like sponsorships and shit and I'm like that's a lot of work for something that I'm doing for the fun of it so how much of one tier one sub do you get uh I don't know I haven't done the maths for it exactly um uh, Australian value like I think the percentage of the overall like the overall sub whatever you end up paying for it um because it's a different value in different places around the world obviously uh, I think it's something like 25% or something overall once it gets its cuts taken out and taxed and whatever else and whatever else and everyone gets their little piece of the pie and then the rest of it sort of comes through I don't mind either way I really don't um, next time I'll just send you a flyer through PayPal no 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 we want all those emotes here that's what we want we want the, emo the emotes um, bits bits uh, are good and hey apparently there's a ghost paypal link out there somewhere that someone found and sent three thousand dollars through which i'd really love to find out where they did it so that i can find that uh, that three thousand dollars because it's not real um 
but yeah, it's um like bits a bits a direct. Oh, someone died. Bits are, are, are like a direct um, donation almost. So every bit is one cent. Um, but I mean, it's all it's all um, it's all for fun, really. The fact that people. The fact that people sub or, or or donate bits and all that sort of stuff is amazing. Is amazing. Um, because like I said, I, I do it for the fun of it. I do it because I enjoy it. I do it because I enjoy a chat. Um, and I've said many times before, like it's... Uh, I'm probably going to be playing games and talking to myself anyway. So I never, I never expect anything out of anybody. I don't even expect people to talk in chat. Um, like if somebody... I'm sure that there's, there's been a few people that lurk and have never said a word um you know the way you see it is how many hours of entertainment do you get out of it yeah for sure for sure and that's a, that's perfectly reasonable like but I, I I will never expect it I will never expect it out of anybody you're about to have a can of beer and that costs you as much as a sub that's an expensive beer you should buy your beers in bulk <laughs> <laughs> that's that's an expensive beer. Get a carton of little little subs. You're good at it though. Well, thank you very much, Lana. I do appreciate the compliment, and it has been a pleasure meeting you today. Um, it's sort of nice putting a. I was going to say it's nice putting a, a face to a name, but um, it's more the other way around. It's nice hearing you talk or seeing you talk. I don't know. Devils talks about you a bit. He's um. I think he might have a little bit of a crush on you. Oh, you drink stupid craft nonsense here? That's fair. You gotta get the nice stuff, you know? Whatever you whatever you find appealing. But yeah. Um a little bit, he's got a little bit of a crush, yeah. Not surprised. Um Anyway. Like I said before. I'm feeling my sort of reaction times dipping quite a bit. I am relatively tired. Uh, I didn't eat the amazing slow-cooked meal that um, that Albatross cooked all day today. Uh, and we'd be going for about nine hours, and it was nearly ready when <laughs> when uh, when I started. So we're gonna have to go and have a feed. Bedtime? Yeah, probably, probably shortly. I'll probably I don't know, put on put on someone to stream. And then, um, and then, um, have a feed, have a feed, have sleep. Seems like a, a relatively good plan. Uh, what we might do though, what we might do. Is we're gonna jump over. Brain, brain, not make words talk good now. Night, night. It was nice to talk. Of course, of course. Um, no, it's always, always appreciated to hang out and have uh, have people to chat to. Um, what we are gonna do though, for anybody that is sticking around, we're gonna jump over and visit a good friend of the channel, um, as we usually do, and we're gonna share the love forward. Uh, his name is Patrickin. He's currently playing Minecraft, um, and uh, he he, uh, he makes mods for Minecraft. He's yeah, very friendly dude, very family oriented, and um, yeah, very chill. So we'll head over there. We'll get that going, and um, I hope everyone's had an awesome day. It has been a pleasure. Thank you for the follow, Nobo. Thank you for the follow, Lana. Thank you for the follow, uh, LA Gamer. Even though. You may not be a real person. Um, and, um, yeah, thank you for the resub, Hib. You're amazing. Everyone that's here is amazing. People that fall asleep and lurk are also amazing. I hope you've all had an amazing day, an awesome day, and I hope you have a better tomorrow. I'll catch you all next time. See ya.